two lawmakers figured in a debate after one of them brought up the issue of conversion of farmlands to subdivisions during the budget deliberations of the Department of Agriculture. The same senator also alleged there are many corrupt DNR officials, which was duly noted by its current chief. Daniel Manalastas has more. As the budget of the Department of Agriculture was tackled in the Senate plenary, Senator Rafi Tulfo and Senator Cincha Villar had a heated debate after Tulfo raised the issue on farmland. Uh, well, in Isabela, uh, in, in, the, in Kawai, know, Isabela there po, will be like that. In Kawai, Isabela po, Kawai City, Isabela, may mga farmland po doon na nakonvert eh, Kawai na po. is a city. Regardless, oh, ang pinag-usapan po natin, yung mga uh, farmland po na nakonvert na po sa isang subdivision o commercial... But, they allow that in cities and capital they allow towns. They, po, they allow conversion po, in cities and capital towns because if they buy your land, they buy it expensive and they you can reinvest the money. According to Villar, in their business, they do not buy agricultural land in the provinces. Ano po ang ginagawa nila sa ganitong nangyaring masamang sistema na paliit na paliit it's, po ang ating farmland. Sorry po, madam ha. Yeah. Na hindi lang po sa Kawayan, sa Isabela, I, I, kundi sa marami po mga probinsya na marami it's... na po mga subdivision na nagsilipa na... And where will the people live if you don't build subdivision? Mga... The issue of Mazungi Geo Reserve, which has gone viral recently and was reportedly infested with armed men, was also raised during the DNR's budget deliberation. According to Senator Tulfo, the department can use the confidential and intel funds here. Now... Meron po kayong 13.9 confidential and intel and extraordinary expense. Now, dapat po, kung ako pong tatanungin, with this amount, kaya niyo po sigurong mag-top ng network of intelligence. These past events occurred not during my, my time po in this position. However, we have obviously deferred at this point to Secretary Ben-Hur Abalos. The senator also hit some officials of the DENR, whom he alleged are corrupt. He suggested lifestyle check. Marami po dyan mga yusek na panahon-panahon na inasor, na dyan na po sa pwesto. Pwede ho ba pakiimbestigan niya mga yusek na yan? At sa, sa tinagal-tagal na nila, eh mukhang nagkakaroon silang dementia. I have, right now I'm not gonna mention names, I have with me proof to show you na marami kang mga tiwaling tauhan dyan sa loob ng DNR. That advice is well taken and please be assured that we are trying to build a team that have the same kind of vision. Daniel Maranastas for The Nation.